Peter, did you throw up in the sink? Peter. Out here in the fields. Yeah, that was me. I was the one who threw up in the sink. I farm for my meals. <laughs> got your nose. Oh, yeah? Well, I got your face. <laughs> Calm down, Chris. It's only a trick. You're back from Manila. You had lumpia for dinner. Then you made love to two Filipino women. And a man. You mean three Filipino women? Wait, that's right. I'm in England. I can just walk past them holding a cup of tea. Morning. 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 Did you see something suspicious about that baby? Well, I did at first, but then he's got the tea vouching for him, doesn't he? Hey, muscly arm. Why the long face? Oh, it's this girl. I can't talk to her. It's like girls are a different species or something. Oh, uh, who needs them? You like popsicles? Well, sure. And you need to come on down to the cellar. I got a whole freezer full of popsicles. Mmm. No, thanks. I gotta get going. Oh, don't make me beg now. <laughs> You're funny. Bye. Get your fat ass back here. Chris, the way to eat an Oreo is to twist it, pull it apart, and lick it. Now you. Oh, here are the marsupials. Peter, what the hell are you doing? Look at me, Lois. I'm Rue. <laughs> Come on, Ma. Let's go watch Pooh trick the bees out of their honey by pretending he's a rain cloud. Peter, did you throw up in the sink? Peter. Out here in the fields. Yeah, that was me. I was the one who threw up in a sink. I farm for my meals. Next time there's a sandwich in the fridge with somebody's name on it, don't eat it, scumbag. Please, you don't understand. Oh, I understand. That lunch didn't have your name on it, but this bullet does. My name is Peter, too! Hey, man, just a heads up. Instead of howling at the moon tonight, we're all gonna yell, Really? That seems weird. I'm just trying to make sure you don't look silly. Cock a doodle doo! <laughs> <laughs> what an idiot! He actually believed me! That's what a rooster says, not a wolf! How was howling at the moon? Shut up! Why aren't you asleep? Have you been drinking again, Phil? That's none of your business! I never wanted a cub! Get out! Get out now and don't ever come back! I just think you're a really cool island, and I'd like to get to know- Oh, God! Oh, I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. You're just so pretty. Please, don't tell the other islands. Oh, yeah, and uh, that nice chicken outside gave me this coupon. I'm sorry. This is expired. You son of a- Pam, I'd like to solve the puzzle. Go tuck yourself in. You got it. Well, you were close, Dad. Man, I still can't believe we missed the phrase, my hairy aunt. <laughs> we're gonna be here for a while. Well, I don't know if... You... Wait, what? We're gonna be here for a while. A while? Yeah, a while. You mean a while? A while. A while. A while. A while. A while. A while. Brian, you're acting weird. Oh, come on, that one doesn't even have an H in it. Ah, where's the damn pull string? Ah! ah! <laughs> you never know what you're gonna find down here. I'm not quite sure how to say this. Kim Bassinger? Ba Basinger? Ba Basinger? Basinger? No. But now, on to the cancer. Oh my god. You are a cancer, right? You were born in July? Lewis! Lewis! Mom! 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 Mommy! 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 Mama! 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 Ma! Ma! 
Ma! Ma! Mum! 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 Mummy! Mummy! Mama! 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 What? Hi. <laughs> and his great grandpa was Thomas Griffin, a great philosopher. Thomas, would you please go look for a job? Why? Good morning, Mrs. Griffin. Hello, 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 hello. <laughs> Just kidding. My mother used to use whiskey whenever I had a toothache. My tooth hurts. Hey, if I'm fat, then Stewie's fat too, because we wear the same size onesie. I like the sauce. Hey, barkeep, whose leg do you have to hump to get a dry martini around here? Gemini. Oh. Capricorn. Oh. <laughs> well, I know you're not a Virgo. Hey, from down here, you look like a Pisces. Ah! Now, on to these test results. My, they're much worse than I thought. Ah. My son got a D-minus on his history test. Now, Mr. Griffin, that liver's got to come out. What? It's been in the microwave for three minutes. It'll get dry. Now. Please. Please? We can't take any more shtick. Please just tell us, is Peter healthy? Oh, yeah, he's fine. He's just really fat. Looks like the killer gutted the victim, strangled him with his own intestines, and then dumped the body in the river. Jinkies, what a mystery. <laughs> You're right, Scoob. We're dealing with one sick son of a bitch. Oh, yeah, and uh, that nice chicken outside gave me this coupon. I'm sorry, this is expired. You son of a... And now here's Ollie Williams with the Blackie Weather Forecast. Ollie? It's gonna rain! So, Doctor, is Peter healthy? My goodness, you'll be dead within a month. What? what? Oh, Hagar the Horrible, if you keep up that lifestyle of pillaging and giant turkey legs, you'll be dead within a month. Now, on to you. So, what do you think? You're pretty healthy, eh? Well, Mr. Griffin, let's take a look at your physical results. Ah! <gasps> There's a spider in here! Now, here we go. Mr. Griffin, you're going to expire in a month. Huh? This is your driver's license, isn't it? Please, Dad, my road test is tomorrow, and you haven't taught me anything. Meg, you uh, may want to find a better teacher than Peter. What are you talking about? I'm a great driver. <laughs> Remember your trip to the Southwest? Beep, beep. Ah, oh, jeez, did I just hit that ostrich? No. Are you sure? Yeah, he's fine. Keep going. Mom, will you take me out to practice driving? I'm teaching a piano lesson in half an hour. Maybe your father can take you. Uh, sorry, Meg. Daddy loves you, but Daddy also loves Star Trek. And in all fairness, Star Trek was here first. Captain's Log, Stardate 8169.7. The Enterprise has just discovered a strange new planet in the Gamma Fallopia star system. Miss Sulu, ahead warp nine. Wow, a song named after a girl. There aren't a million of those already. Name 20. Rosanna, Roxanne, Michelle, Allison, Sarah, Angie, Brandy, Mandy, Gloria, Cecilia, Maggie Mae, Jessica, Nancy, Barbara, Ann, Billie Jean, Layla, Lola, Polly, Helena, Jenny from the Block. Name six more. Sherry, Laura, Wendy, Maria, Peggy Sue, Minnie the Moocher. Name five more. Tracy, Jean, Jane, Mary Ann, Eleanor Rigby. Go fuck yourself. So, Peter, where do you see yourself in five years? Don't say doing your wife. Don't say doing your wife. Don't say doing your wife. Doing your... Son? Got peeping in the ladies' locker room. Okay, move the towel. Move the towel. Oh, 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 they spotted me. Uh, this is advanced physics, right? Ah! I have a right to defend myself as a woman. No means no! Ah, what the hell is wrong with you? I'm sorry. I just came from that orientation seminar about college dating. They say all peoples must go through some hard times. Well, we Jews are getting ours out of the way early. From here on out, it's gonna be nothing but smooth sailing. You know, I was just thinking, when I was your age, my Uncle Roy shared a beer with me. I drank it, and I was so excited I fell asleep. I must have tossed and turned something fierce, because when I woke up, my pants were off. Never saw much of Uncle Roy after that. Turns out we weren't even related. Oh, no. If there's four tickets and one of them's gone, that, 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 that leaves... This many. All right, I'm going to work. Somebody's got to put food on this table. Tricking her should be easier than escaping from Canadian Alcatraz. Can I go through here? Just be back by bedtime. Okay. Why won't you let me get laser surgery? Because I just don't think it's safe. Okay, I just need to make a quick incision here and we should be all done, Mrs. Wilson. Luke, use the force. Really? Because I was just going to make it. Use the force. Okay. <laughs> Are you happy? I've never been happy.
What the? Oh, man, we're supposed to do a show tonight. Where's the audience? I don't see them anywhere. If only they could make some noise to let me know they're here. We're here. Oh, there you are. Oh, thank God. Well, we're room for improvement, so without further ado, I need a place. Your ass. <laughs> okay, come on now, something serious. Your mom's ass. Oh, I get it. Tap me, Quagmire, tap me. Quagmire went to the bank to donate sperm because it's a sperm bank. Okay, this is one we call going bananas. Okay, I'm a banana. I'm a banana. Peel the banana. Peel the banana. Now go, bananas. Go, go, bananas. Go! Whoa! Come on, you guys, do it with me. Go, bananas! Yeah! Whole body, Joe, whole body. Whoa! Come on, go, bananas! Yeah. Am I doing it? Am I doing it? What's the matter with you guys? How do we know where to start looking? The tracking beacon I shot into Mare West's ankle will allow us to locate him. Wow, those are the Russian people? Hey, they're not bears on unicycles! You are under arrest! Oh, time to lose this costume. <laughs> Cause we're in Russia! Sessions presents A Peter Griffin Christmas. Featuring such standards as... <laughs> Everybody look at the snow in the yard. And who could forget? I brought these gifts for you. They're up in my bum. And everyone's favorite. La 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 la. Look at the bells. Look at the bells. Holy crap, here comes Jesus. And he doesn't look too happy. Merry Christmas, everyone. Sunday's my internet porn night. Oh, yeah. You're my Chinese Lois. <laughs> All right. Quagmire, look out! Oh, no! Jeez, that was a close one. Yeah, but at least nobody got hurt. That's right, Joyce. Quahog's own Goldman's Pharmacy made headlines across the country after a banner of theirs caused the bus to drive off a bridge, tragically killing all the teenagers on board. Many of the students tweeted about the accident as it was happening. We have a few here. From at Jenny94, water seriously cold, yo. Here's at the Ted69. I'm gonna survive this, LOL JK. JK indeed. Guys, what the hell's going on back there? Remember, each pill has to go into the correct bottle. Eh, this ain't so hard. Boner. Well, look, uh, I don't know, maybe there's something we can do to help you drum up some business. You know, get the word out. Like what? Hey, you just leave that to us. Is opening and closing the cash register a bunch of times helping business yet? No. Okay, then we'll do other stuff. You know, most of the world's problems stem from poor self-image. <laughs> hey. Hey. You okay there, Mr. Crocodile? Huh? Wake up, wake up, wake up. You need some lotion, Mr. Badskin? Huh? 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 Yeah, there you go. Ah! 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 Oh, God! Oh, God! Ah! 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 And at the top of the second half, it's 16 to 9. Easton leads the scoring with four. And that's why she commands $7,000 a year. These gals sure do make it look difficult. But is having this minor skill worth being so unattractive? That's for the fan to decide. Yay! Apple to freshness, life is more fun When you're chewing the great taste of double fresh gum
Hey, we should go to the circus. Good morning, Hebrews and Shebrews. What a glorious Jewish day. Hey, how about all those coupons in the Sunday paper, huh? Some good deals there. Hey, you know, I went into a store last week and they wanted 800 bucks for a TV, but I ushed them down to 500. Ah! So what's the deal with Chris? Is he actually, like, still in Africa? No, no, he's not. So that was all... that was just a bit. Yeah, he'll be back next week. Great. Boy, who would have thought all this trouble could be caused by simply uttering the phrase, gosh, that Italian family at the next table sure is quiet. Агент 2476 Night ждет, пока мы скажем, что сделать с нашей стороны. Пожалуйста, подождите, пока мы вам позвоним. Shut up, 2476. Don't need a translator for that one. Tell him to come back when he's ready to act like an adult. Charles Yamamoto went from eating champion to cold-blooded killer. Who'd have thought? Wait a minute, Joe. That's the guy who opened the door to my cell yesterday and told me I could leave the asylum. Ah, uh, is that right? Well, then it all makes sense. Yamamoto wanted it to look like you broke out on your own. That way, when he murdered Chris, it was a cinch that you would take the blame. Well, Patrick, I guess we all owe you an apology. Patrick? Where did he go? He was just right here. What happened? Damn it, he must have gotten away. How is that possible? I don't know, but I better make it look like there was a struggle. Someone punched me in the face. I'm a good friend to you. Come on, let's go. Yeah, but wait, this is our last chance to do a panty raid. Yay, Fat Camp! We got it! Oh no, a gust of wind! And now back to Roundtable with Al Michaels, Harold Ramis, Ray Romano, and Kermit the Frog. These zoning laws are infringing on the uh, rights of citizens. If I might interrupt for a minute, I'd like to point You've out You've had that your time. Let someone else I speak. haven't said a word. It was that guy. Don't look at me. I can't get a word in edgewise. Well, then who the hell's been talking this whole time? Oh, well, that's a hard question. Look, there's Mr. Quagmire's plane. Ladies and gentlemen, keep your eye on the sky for the aerial acrobatics of Captain Glenn Quagmire. Whoa, gonna need some help here. <laughs> All right. This is boring. I'd rather be home watching that video from the ring. Peter, don't. They say if you watch that video, you die. Ah, that's a lot of baloney. Peter, what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be at work? Yeah, I quit my job, Lois. You what? Yeah, we're rich now. I don't need to be working. Oh, you should have been there, Lois. I told Angela what she could do with that job, just like I always fantasized. Angela, I just want to thank you for several extremely pleasurable years working for this corporation. Uh, certain unexpected developments have created a situation where I am no longer in need of employment. Uh, I would be remiss, however, if I did not extend my gratitude to you for your unwavering fairness and belief in me, and there is a giant poo on your desk. Hey, Chris. Guess who I just scored as my date to the homecoming dance? Vice Principal McGuire. Really? Yeah, her husband just died of ALS, so she is ready to get at it. Hey there, strong guy. Not now, Brenda. She says I have the body of a 50-year-old before it gets ALS. Dad, are you sure it's okay that we took Brian's car? Yeah, it's his own fault. He's the one who keeps his key in the visor like a carefree hillbilly. Okay, everybody out. I don't want the cool kids to know I'm your dad. Oh, can't the kids just walk? You know I like to watch two full movies before I go to work. No, Peter, they can't walk. It's three miles. <sighs> Fine, I'll take them. But you better keep those goggles, because I'm going to put them to good use tonight. Once the floor is full of sawdust, we can eat peanuts in here. 
Damn it, where the hell did I put that? What are you looking for, Brian? That steak bone you gave me last night. I can't remember what the hell I did with it. What, didn't you bring it outside? Ah! Holy crap, Quagmire, you all right? No, I'm not all right. My head's gushing blood, you idiot! Take your hand away. Oh, boy. All right, hold still, Quagmire. Oh, my God, a piece of your brain came out. Yeah, well, that can't be good. Well, maybe it's not so bad. I can feed it to my pet zombie. Here you go. Yeah, you're hungry, aren't you? He was a rescue. When I found him, he was just walking face first into a chain link fence downtown. What are you doing there? Planting some flowers? Hey, look, why don't you go bother Joe, huh? I can't. He's in Vegas for the weekend, seeing that handicapped Cher impersonator. If I could turn. Time! This is the biggest city novation I've ever seen! Peter, I need you to take Chris and Meg to school. Today's the day I finally kill that squirrel that's been eating our tomatoes. Try to get like eight of them this time. I want to make bruschetta. Extreme outside. Colorado co-ed. Toast a dozen on the inside. Questers Jet. Who farted? Who farted on the outside? It's close! Who farted in the winner's circle? If I were you, I'd keep your mouth shut till you talk to a lawyer. I didn't kill anybody! God, is this what black people see all the time? <gasps> Look! Ah! He's dead. Oh my God! Nice. Top eight answers on the board, here we go. Name a word starting with the letter S. Snake. Huh? Snake. 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 <laughs> Name a word starting with the letter S that many women call Steve Harvey. You know, it actually looks like the Native Americans have done all right for themselves. They do seem to have a lot of shops. And it looks like they have medical care as well. Ma'am, I'm sorry, but I've done this several times today, and your husband just isn't responding. Well, have you tried this? Ma'am, this is a place of medicine. And their popular music is interesting. And here it is, the number one song for the 10,000th week in a row. Hiya, hiya, hiya. Hiya, 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 hiya. All right, who's ready for a campfire song, huh? Oh, come on, Dad. That's lame. It's not lame, Meg. Look, those people over there are having a good time. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. When she comes. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. When she comes. Makes you think, doesn't it? Mm. I mean, what's it all about? Makes me. Wow. <laughs> Something. Don't worry, Lois, I'll get rid of it. It'll be a piece of cake, just like my penis enhancement. I want it to hang down to my knees. They moved up my knees. I don't know what the kids are complaining about. This ain't so bad. I know, this is fun. I haven't been to a pep rally in years. Do you have school spirit? Yeah! yeah. Do you have school spirit? Yeah! Who's got the most school spirit? I do! Show me your school spirit!
The players will remember this while they're playing. Well, Lois, I gotta say, it's great to have you home from prison. Uh, it's great to be home. Hey, uh, I gotta ask, are you gonna stay that jacked forever? I don't know. Do you like it? I, I, I do, and I don't. You know, it, it, it was it was nice being held up against a wall, but when you made me suck the hairdryer, I, I, I enjoyed it. I did, but I, I, I don't want to do that specific thing again. Well, that's too bad, because I'm ready for round two. Just got to make sure the kids don't come in. <laughs> now no one can get in, and no one can get out. Hands on the headboard, Chief. Yes, ma'am. Oh, my God. I can see. Oh, God, but if anybody finds out, it'll ruin my ICU brand. Ugh, Peter told me he'd been doing laundry. Now, now I'm even wondering if he lost those 75 pounds like he said. What's that, Lois? I'm just on the spin bike. Got a good sweat going. Boy, you're right. Sarah loves those hills. I just haven't met you yet. Oh, cool. Your mom thinks of me when she's doing your dad. What? Seriously, I drive older women nuts. I can make your mom and aunt kiss. This is a very skeevy packing product. What's that, Daddy? Well, that's Mercury, Jake, the planet closest to the sun. What is doing down here by the wharf? I haven't the foggiest, but we should probably ask a scientist. I'm a guy, you jackass! But it's just so sad that young people can't pay attention to something longer than six sec... <laughs> Whoa! What the hell, you guys? I was talking. You know, there's more to life than just what's on your phone. Wrong, idiot. Anyone know how to turn these things off? We now return to Damn Nature, You Scary on BET. Damn, look at that son bitch go. He hauling ass. That thing come by my house, I kill it. <laughs> that little rat-looking thing just got ate. Damn Nature, You Scary. <laughs> 